Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you a very beautiful chess game. This is the game between Jeroen Pickett and Zurab Sturua. Game was played in European Team Championship in Debrecen in 1992. And where is Debrecen? Debrecen is the second largest city in Hungary after Budapest. Pickett had white pieces and he started with d4. Struva played d5. c4, e6, knight to c3, bishop to e7, knight to f3, knight to f6. So we have queen's gambit declined. Bishop to g5, h6, attacking bishop. And white captured knight. More popular move is bishop to h4. Okay, in our game, white captured knight with bishop. Bishop takes bishop. e3. And black castled kingside. Queen to c2 was played. By far the most popular move is rook to c1. Why these moves? Why not bishop to d3? If bishop to d3, then black can capture pawn on c4 and then bishop has to move again. Okay, so queen to c2 was played. Knight to a6. Rook to d1. Lining rook with black queen. c5. D takes on c5, and now queen to a5, moving queen off the d file, and also queen is pinning knight now. C takes on d5, knight takes on c5, and surely white had a look at this continuation, pawn takes pawn, and then bishop takes on e6, white is a pawn up, but black is ahead in development. So instead of taking the pawn, knight to d4, e takes on d5, a3. The idea is to play b4 to fork knight and queen. So knight had to move, knight to e6. Again, if knight takes knight, this is only helping black. So in this position, perhaps the best move would be knight to b3 attacking queen. Knight to b5 was played. a6, b4 attacking queen, queen to d8, and white captured pawn with rook on d5. And white is happy. He won a pawn. What is the cost? The cost is that white is behind in development. Can black take advantage of this? What do you think? How would you continue now if you had black pieces? Black played bishop to d7. And it is white to move. And surely white considered moving knight because knight is under attack. So this is the first move that comes to mind. Knight to d6. Probably, probably he saw then this move. Bishop to c6 attacking rook. Rook must move. Let's say rook to d1. And now black has this very brilliant move. Knight to d4. Cutting communication between rook and knight on d6. So after logical, pawn takes knight. Queen takes knight. And black is better. So in this position, white played queen to d2. So queen and rook attacking bishop. Pawn takes knight. Rook takes on d7 attacking queen. And we have reached critical position of the game. It is black to move. What would you play in this position? if you had black pieces. 
If you wish, you can pause this video and you can try to find the best move for black in this position. Are you ready? Before I show you the best move, I will show you the move on which white counted. He probably thought that black would play queen to c8. So bishop and queen are now attacking knight on c3. In this position then, white can play knight to e4 or even knight to b1. And white is okay. But in this position, white was surprised. A lot. Big time. Black captured rook with queen. Oh boy, oh boy. What else? Queen takes queen. Now bishop takes knight. Check. King to e2. Rook from f to d8. Attacking queen. Queen takes on b7. And now very clever move. Knight to g5. There is no escape for king. He can't go to f3 now. That's why white played e4. Rook takes pawn on a3. And now have a good look at this position. Bishop and rook. White bishop and white rook are not participating in the game. Four black pieces are fighting against queen. And she is not Bruce Lee, is she? Queen takes on b5. Check. King to e3. In this position, black made a move and white resigned. Can you guess the move? The move is bishop to d2. Check. Black resigned in view of this continuation. King to e2. Bishop to f4. King to e1. And now there is checkmate in 2. Can you see it? Rook to a1 check. King to e2. Rook to d2. Check. Mate. What a brilliant queen sacrifice. And what a brilliant attack. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess. And bye for now.